Harry in Antwerp, Belgium writes to me, Paul, I heard you talk about Balanced Interconnects, a turntable manufacturer, Project Audio, owned by my friend Heinz, is making a lot of claims about balanced interconnects from the pickup element to the phono amplifier. Do you think this is a valid claim? Yes, I do. Oops, don't tell Terry I got my foot up on the couch. <laughs> that drives her crazy. But she's not here. <laughs> and she doesn't watch my videos. So I can get away with it. Okay. Um, you know, for 50-something years, starting in 1974, everything that we did in the beginning was phono-based. And from that very first phono preamplifier that I designed with Stan, I have to tell you, I have been shocked, questioning why is this single-ended. Why is this not balanced? Way back then, we would build balanced phono preamps just to see if it sounded different. It did. It was better. It's the right way to go. But back then and for many decades after, no turntable arm manufacturer produced balanced interconnect cables attached to their arm and cartridge. So what was the use? Who's going who's gonna to go in there and disconnect all of that? that mean, so it, it was a, a futile effort. It always, I mean, just drove me crazy. So let me explain why. If, if you think about it, any time that you have a balanced signal, especially one coming from a transformer or a coil, it's always best to keep it balanced. Think about a phono cartridge, moving coil, moving magnet, it doesn't matter. At the end of the day, there's a coil of wire that is either moving closer and farther away from a permanent magnet or a permanent magnet moving closer and farther away from a coil. Whatever the case, it's all based on that coil. And that coil has two wires. It's a coil of wire, and out it goes. And there's a balanced push-pull signal. And for some reason, it's always been chopped off. So the one side of it has been grounded, and you're losing 6 dB of gain. I mean, there's all kinds of reasons not to do that. So I applaud Heinz for taking it on, because you know what? He makes turntables and he makes arms and stuff. So he has the liberty and the freedom to go ahead and build it correctly and then make products that accept it. So our new upcoming PMG Signature Phono Preamplifier, fully balanced. And we made a decision way, I didn't even know that Heinz was doing this, so thank you for that, but, uh, and project. So this is kind of news to me and good news. We decided, you know what? Let's just build balanced inputs on all of our phono stages from now on and hope the industry catches up. Sounds like that's about to happen. There you go. All right, thanks. Bye.